When you invest in a four season state like Michigan, you quickly learn that water issues, when ignored, will destroy a house. In this episode, I share my story of how some seamless gutters helped me dodge a bullet before I put this East Point, Michigan flip back on the market. You don't want to miss this. I'm Randy Vaughn, and this is Michigan Flip. I'm the real deal. I look for dilapidated properties that need work, time, energy, money. I renovate, I hire, I fire, I get injured, I get filthy. I deal with contractors, I deal with with men and women, the dead creatures and the living creatures. Whatever it takes to get a house back on the market. And I share my experiences with you. Why? If I can do this, you can do this. After I finish carpet and trim on the main floor, I'm excited to button up this basement. The walls are discolored, but the foundation's solid. I clean everything up and start rolling. But I return three days later to find my paint has dropped to the floor and my walls are still wet. What the heck? So this wall on the top, it's, it's dry. I know my hand's dirty. <laughs> I got worker man hands. Worker man hands. Uh, but it's dry here and down below. <laughs> it's damp. So it gets damp as it goes down the wall. It's dripped to the bottom like a birthday cake in the hot room. Why is my basement bleeding to the floor? I think it starts a roof. I bought this house with a new roof in February. The gutters had been torn off and never replaced. So when they build a house, so where the foundation wall sits, they have to dig four feet beyond. When they're done, they have to backfill that with gravel. The least path of resistance for water is the gravel, and it's going to want to settle towards negative space, which is your basement. With no sign of any long-term erosion, I'm banking water has pulled against the house, and detouring it with some new gutters is the fix. You want to protect your foundation. 90% of all claims made against houses are water-related. These DIY gutters are great for small sections and downspouts, but when doing a whole roof line, I use seamless gutters. Less seams means less chance to break apart or leak. I've requested my gutters before my bleeding paint debacle. Good thing because there's a wait and the basement's on hold until my install. So it just crimps and bends that exactly in that shape? Yep. Janner Sheet Metal is a local company. They've been doing gutters for years. This roll-forming gutter machine is extruding rolled aluminum. Now, where have I seen something like this before? How many feet is that? 40 feet. I think we're going to have to go all the way around the truck. I'm going to make it. Gutters are always hung angled towards a downspout, never hanging straight. Hangers are just screwed to the house, so this gutter snaps in. The corners click together with a miter strip. You make it look so easy! A 45 degree miter corner with one joint is ideal. Much better than the neighbors, right? The number one mistake people make when doing gutters is not pushing their gutters downspout six feet from the foundation. So it's recommended you put a six foot extension on your downspout. You can do it a few different ways. You can buy a flexible extension at the DIY stores, or you could actually sink the downspout into the ground into another drain and drain the rainwater into your yard through a drain system. There's more time and energy and all that. Or you can make a six foot extension from actual downspout, which is the easiest and cheapest. I went the cheap route. If you're doing your yard work, it can get in the way, but here's a pro tip. You had the grass cut. Quick release. And this nail's gonna go in there. That way you can pull that guy out. And that's gonna hold that on? Yep. 15 years now, the same thing I've always done. I like it. For this flip, the garage only gets front gutters. Hey, I'm just trying to save a few bucks. In a half of a day, my 250 foot seamless gutter job with four mitered corners and five downspouts is complete. My cost, 875 bucks, and I get a five year warranty. It continues to rain per usual in Michigan, but it, it's pretty amazing what a difference the gutters have made in literally less than a week. My basement has dried up, then painted, and this chapter is closed. <laughs> Under the next project.
it's never ending. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Taking a video of, of my buyer here. This is Stella. She's very interested in this phone. She wants to, whoa, she, she wants to sit. <laughs>